in today's video I'm going to find out whether the Windows game mode does actually boost your FPS in Fortnite Chapter 2 Season 8 or not. And trust me guys, the results are shocking. I did a bunch of hardware demanding, brave and dangerous tests to get you exactly the results we need for today's video. And to be completely honest guys, I didn't expect these results we got today at all. By the way guys, I'm also right now giving away a GK61 with optical Gatron yellow switches on my Twitter, so make sure to check that one out after the video. And without any further ado, let's get straight into this topic. And yeah guys, if we literally take a look right now here on the footage in the background, you can see it for yourself that without the game mode, we literally gained like 30 to 40 FPS more and the FPS are way more consistent and I'm literally shocked here because Microsoft themselves praised this game mode as the easiest way to actually boost your FPS and reduce latency in games. They said it applies for any game and every PC, you will always see less latency and more FPS. But as we can see right now here in the background, I did tons of tests guys. I was running around, driving around, trying to simulate exactly the same scenery on both pictures so you can see it for yourself exactly. As you can see, we're right now here driving in the background a little bit and there's like tons of stuff happening. I also later on tried to blow up a car to see if we get any more FPS drops or not or if the FPS are actually more consistent. And I'm actually really disappointed here in Microsoft because they said themselves even that this is the best way to boost FPS and yeah we can truly see here in the background that this is not the case. I also tried to replicate some more situations and I'm later on gonna give you also some gameplay and I have to simply say this is definitely not the way to do it and I'm later on in the video also going to show you how to disable the game mode so you guys can actually get more FPS here and keep in mind guys I'm right now here running Windows 11 which is basically a reskinned version of Windows 10 so therefore there shouldn't be way too much issues here. Of course there might be some optimization differences between Windows 10 and Windows 11 at the current state but even Microsoft themselves mentioned that even at the current state of Windows 11 there should be no extra issues and you should be able to utilize the game mode to its fullest potential and actually boost FPS but we can clearly see here in some situation we lose up to 50 FPS which is crazy when it comes down then later to more natural gameplay the FPS difference isn't as big but I mean it's still like 10 to 20 FPS and especially on a low end PC or people with like not so strong GPUs this might make a huge difference between the game actually being playable or not and especially if you're on a low end PC you're utilizing already the alpha performance mode and you just simply want to get max FPS you might think for yourself yo there's this game mode built into Windows I actually have to utilize it but yeah that's actually wrong like it's not helping at all yeah guys just let me know what you think about this down in the comment section below and now I'm going to show you how to actually disable the game mode and as mentioned guys I'm just going to show you now real quick how you can actually disable the Windows game mode and it's super super easy all you guys have to do is go into a Windows search bar and tap in game mode until you find the game mode settings and just simply open it up here and there you can see right now already that we got the game mode here and it says usually optimize your PC for play by turning things off in the background but I mean guys you can see it for yourself I benchmarked Fortnite in season 8 and we literally gained like 20, 30, 40, 50 FPS while turning the game mode off so therefore I wouldn't recommend you to use it right now in this season so therefore please just make sure that this is actually turned to off and afterwards you can just simply close this and restart your PC and everything should be applied 100% and yeah guys this is it for today's video if you enjoyed it please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel and and as well also make sure to check out my twitter guys for the gk61 giveaway and also don't forget to check out my channel guys i have tons of optimization guides for boosting fps in fortnite decreasing input delay and just overall getting like a better performance in game and with that said have a great day have a great night whenever you're watching this and until next time stay awesome i'm out peace